every day we receive questions regarding mold uh, many people they get concerned when they see mold growing in their homes and sometimes they panic I would say that well mold is a health hazard what is mold mold actually refers to a group of microorganisms which belong to the kingdom that we call fungi. This video shows the different types of molds grown in the laboratory uh, from samples collected from homes and offices. As you can see, molds generally come in different colors. Some are white, others are grayish, others may look black, while others may look almost clear as if they, they don't have any color. The color of the mold doesn't really determine whether it is harmful or not so when people talk of black mold it really doesn't mean that uh, if one is having mold that appears black that uh, they are actually in danger of mold however potentially all molds are harmful but uh, remember that the common molds that we find in homes are the same molds which are commonly found in outdoor environment and sometimes they are even in higher concentrations in the outside environment than they are in our homes so we tend to inhale millions of spores when we are outdoors maybe in the park or in the forest than when we are in our houses that means that uh, unless there is excessive um, mold growth in a home there is no need to panic when one finds just a few spots of mold in their homes however no amount of mold should be allowed to grow indoors because with the time and if there is moisture that mold would definitely continue uh, growing and producing more and more mold and once those pores become airborne then they would uh, affect those people who inhale them in particular those who may be sensitive to mold if you are concerned that probably you have mold in the in the air you may want to conduct a near testing which would show whether you have mold or not. If you need more information on how you can do mold testing in the, uh, for, for the air samples, you can give us a call at 905-290-9101 and we can explain to you how to uh, collect air samples. Thank you.